At the crossroads of wealth and royalty lies a realm of unimaginable opulence. From billion-dollar palaces to gold-plated cars, exotic animals to private jets, the extravagant lifestyles of Arab royalty and billionaires redefine the meaning of lavish living. Join us as we explore the lifestyles of 20 of the richest Arab kings in the world. Number 20. King Salman and Mohammed bin Salman Saudi Arabia's ruling royal family has a net worth of about $1.4 trillion, which is 16 times more than that of the British royal family. The ruler of this family, King Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud, resides in extreme opulence within the royal court palace complex in Riyadh, valued at over $500 million. This immense mega palace spans 1.4 million dollar square feet and required copious amounts of Italian marble, gold, and other imported materials during its construction. It contains several stunningly decorated grand halls, mosques, and museums that integrate modern amenities with historic architecture. Within the palace compound lies the king's outrageous car collection of over 7,000 vehicles, including a 4.8 million Mercedes-Benz SL600 with luxurious customization. However, his son, Mohammed bin Salman MBS, is considered the de facto ruler and one of the most powerful men in the world, despite being in his 30s. MBS has demonstrated his vast royal fortune through record-shattering purchases. In 2017, he spent an astonishing $450 million to acquire Salvatore Mundi, the 500-year-old painting of Christ by Leonardo da Vinci, at auction through a proxy bidder. This made it the most expensive painting ever sold. MBS also splurged over $300 million to buy the Chateau Louis XIV, a 50,000 square feet palace in France dubbed the world's most expensive home by Fortune magazine. This opulent chateau contains 10 lavish bedrooms, indoor and outdoor pools, a private cinema, a wine cellar, and a moat with an underwater viewing room. Its fountains, gold leaf statues, and marble columns reinforce regal luxury. Number 19. Prince Al-Walid bin Talal Saudi Prince Al-Walid bin Talal resides within the apex of extreme wealth as one of the richest billionaires on earth. His kingdom-holding investment firm owns valuable stakes in globally renowned companies. The prince leverages this tremendous fortune to acquire possessions such as private jets and cars encapsulating extravagance. His flagship purchase was an Airbus A380 Super Jumbo Jet valued at around $500 million. After customizing the interior with opulent amenities, his renamed Flying Palace reflected a price tag of over $600 million. Subsequently, he sold it in favor of a smaller, yet still lavish $20 million Boeing 747. The more modest jet provides ample luxury with multiple bedrooms, entertainment systems, and a dedicated prayer room for the prince. Still, standout features include throne chairs inlaid with gemstones and washrooms clad in marble. On land, Prince Al-Walid owns a fleet of Rolls Royces and exotic cars, including a diamond-covered Mercedes SL600 costing $48 million. Over $300,000 in individual diamonds coat the exterior in exclusive mother-of-pearl white. This royal star model was created by Mercedes to satisfy His Highness, who wished to literally add more sparkle to his jewelry inspired car collection. The lavishness reflects the designer brand's willingness to cater to elite whims with one-of-a-kind glitz. From private Boeing, 747s, to diamond-studded Mercedes, Prince Al-Walid spares no expense whenever luxury is concerned. For him, amassing great wealth means acquiring the high society symbols that boldly display his noble stature to the world. Number 18. Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum As ruler of Dubai and Prime Minister of the UAE, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum oversees a personal fortune estimated at $14 billion. He indulges in symbols of wealth fitting his noble stature, including the $500 million Zabil Palace and a $1 billion mega yacht collection. Zabil Palace encompasses 119 acres in Dubai's Al Tadina district and serves as Sheikh Mohammed's primary residence. The 100,000-square-foot palace contains advanced amenities like an indoor pool with remote-controlled submarines. The majestic architecture includes intricately carved arches and handcrafted fixtures made with precious metals, marble, and wood throughout. 
Gold detailing accents the window frames, doors, furniture, and more in a dazzling display. Outside, landscaped lawns and gardens surround a fortress-like building with Islamic geometric patterns. Zabil Palace powerfully conveys royalty and grandeur. However, Sheikh Mohammed also frequently escapes by sea courtesy of his personal yacht fleet valued at over $1 billion. It includes the 531-foot Dubai Mega Yacht costing roughly $400 million to construct. This floating palace has eight decks, a mosaic swimming pool, a cinema, and a capacity for 115 people, including the crew. Another crown jewel is his $300 million platinum yacht with a 25-foot high atrium and dedicated disco. No expenses were spared to maximize luxury. Sheikh Mohammed also owns the Folk Al Salama, a 257-foot super yacht with a stunning curving atrium and over 40 different types of marble. From the sea to the streets, his luxury car collection includes a Mercedes SLS and a one million million dollar Rolls Royce Phantom. Clearly, Sheikh Mohammed spares no expense when it comes to living an extravagant, envy-inducing lifestyle. Number 17. Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan rules Abu Dhabi as crown prince of the UAE's richest emirate, resulting in a personal net worth estimated at $30 billion. Lavish real estate and rare hypercars fill his portfolio. The Emirates Palace Hotel in Abu Dhabi, owned by Mohammed bin Zayed, stands out as one of the world's most luxurious at an estimated value of around $3 billion. The 105-acre beachfront complex has 394 rooms and 92 suites housed in palatial golden-domed buildings. Underwater lights make the swimming pool seem luminous blue. The lobby dazzles with 1001 Swarovski crystal chandeliers. Gold, marble, and mother-of-pearl appointments create a breathtaking oriental fantasy. In terms of private residences, Bin Zayed's assets include a $45 million mansion in Beverly Hills. This enormous 19,000-square-foot palace has eight bedrooms, 13 bathrooms, a tennis court, and a movie theater. When it comes to vehicles, His Royal Highness boasts some of the rarest, most expensive supercars on the planet. The crown jewel is the $18.7 million Bugatti La Voiture Noire, one of the most coveted cars worldwide. Number 16. Hamad bin Jassim Al Thani. Hamad bin Jassim bin Jabir Al Thani, often referred to by his initials HBJ, is known for his luxurious residences and opulent lifestyle. As a member of Qatar's ruling Al Thani family and a former prime minister, he has amassed an immense fortune that allows him to indulge in extravagance. One of HBJ's most notable displays of luxury is his lavish $47 million Manhattan mansion purchased in 2008. This sprawling 21,000-square-foot estate spans five stories and boasts a grand reception hall, a luxurious jacuzzi, an indoor game area, and a sunroom. The property oozes opulence with its soaring ceilings, intricate moldings, marble floors, and top-of-the-line furnishings. While most billionaires would be content with such an extravagant property, HBJ found it inadequate. In a display of his tremendous wealth, he turned down a $100 million penthouse in Manhattan's prestigious 157 Columbus development. His rationale was that the building had only two elevators, which he considered highly unusual for a luxury high-rise. HBJ's real estate portfolio extends far beyond New York. He owns several other lavish properties, including a historic London townhouse purchased for over $120 million. This mansion was previously home to prestigious families like the Rothschilds. Beyond real estate, HBJ also indulges in other luxuries befitting his status. He previously owned one of the world's largest super yachts, the 482-foot Al Merkab, before selling it to the Emir of Qatar. When it comes to cars, HBJ favors Rolls Royces and Bentleys with custom luxurious finishes. However, being a lover of beauty and design, he has been known to add more unique models to his collection. His $350,000 crystal-studded Mercedes-Benz is a one-of-a-kind piece incorporating expensive Swarovski crystals in its interior, detailing. Number 15. King Hamad of Bahrain King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa of Bahrain leverages his estimated $2 billion royal fortune to finance an extravagant lifestyle filled with luxuries suiting a monarch. This includes ownership of the lavish Al Rifa Palace and a car collection worth millions. Spanning over 100 acres, the enormous Rifa Palace incorporates a blend of Arabic and Asian architectural elements. The interiors display grand chandeliers, ornamental columns, and lavish furnishings accented with gold throughout. 
King Hamad's living quarters contain his own private cinema, golden throne, and golf course. For convenience, the palace also has its own helipad. Estimates place its value at over $60 million. The king owns a custom Mercedes-Benz worth $380,000 featuring bulletproof windows, puncture-proof tires, and an oxygen system. He also paid $500,000 for a rare Lamborghini Aventador. Yet his most prized vehicle may be his six-door Bugatti Cento Dis Veyron Grand Sport, one of only eight ever made. This 16-cylinder supercar likely costs between $2.5 to $3 million and can reach 60 miles per hour in 2.4 seconds. For chartered flights, King Hamad utilizes a lavish Boeing 7478 VIP jet. The estimated $400 million airplane has 5,000 square feet of cabin space and a master suite with a private shower. Number 14. King Abdullah II of Jordan. King Abdullah II of Jordan draws significant wealth from his Hashemite dynasty's rule and extensive investments. While Jordan itself lacks oil, the king leverages his fortune to acquire magnificent homes domestically and worldwide. The Washington Post reported King Abdullah II spent around $70 million on oceanfront properties in Malibu between 2014-17. He purchased three adjacent lots totaling nearly three acres with direct beach access. This compound provides the Jordanian ruler with an elite Southern California enclave for pursuing leisure and meetings. Tight security keeps it shrouded in privacy when not in use. In addition to West Coast opulence, King Abdullah II also owns 14 posh residences in central London, mostly registered under secretive shell companies. These discrete holdings are together valued at over 116 million. Notable London properties connected to the king include an 11 million residence next to Kensington Palace Palace purchased in 1995 and a 16 million dollar mansion neighboring Buckingham Palace bought in 2017. Number 13. King Mohammed VI of Morocco. King Mohammed VI of Morocco inhabits some of the most lavish palaces in the world, displaying wealth and power accumulated through his Alayawite dynasty. They provide both beauty and security as seats of Moroccan governance. The Dar al makshin Palace in Rabat serves as the king's primary residence. Also called Venue of Happiness, this enormous complex houses the Royal College and boasts grand architecture with French and Arab design influences. For vacations, the king frequents his seaside summer palace in Agadir with stunning Atlantic Ocean vistas. Another favored retreat is his Fez Palace amid oasis-like royal gardens. Seeking spectacular views abroad, King Mohammed VI purchased a mega mansion near the Eiffel Tower in Paris, valued at 100 million from a Saudi prince. This bolsters his portfolio of grand foreign estates. Through Moroccan palace life and strategic high-end investments overseas, the monarch not only rules but also lives like royalty. Number 12. Sultan Hassan al Bolkaya. Sultan Hassan al Bolkiya of Brunei is renowned for his lavish lifestyle and extravagant spending. As one of the wealthiest people on earth with an estimated net worth of 20 billion, his most iconic asset is the sprawling, magnificent Istana Nurul Iman Palace. This architectural wonder is recognized by Guinness World Records as the largest residential palace in the world at a mammoth 2.15 million square feet. The palace possesses 1,788 rooms, 257 bathrooms, five swimming pools, a mosque, and vast, beautifully landscaped gardens. Its true value is considered priceless given its immense size, opulence, and heritage as the Sultan's official residence. Beyond palaces, Sultan Bolkia is also known for indulging in remarkably expensive whims like a $20,000 haircut. He once flew his London-based barber by private jet to Brunei just to trim his hair over 30 minutes in the comfort of a five-star hotel suite. Even the Sultan's vehicle collection with over 5,000 cars is valued at billions. Number 11. Turkey bin Abdullah. As a member of the Saudi royal family, Prince Turkey bin Abdullah is no stranger to extravagance. With a fortune estimated in the billions, his car collection vividly showcases his penchant for luxury. At over $22 million, it ranks among the most expensive private collections in the world. One of Prince Turkey's most eye-catching automobiles is his gold Bugatti Veyron. The limited edition Veyron Grand Sport Vitesse routinely costs around $2.5 million, 
However, Turkey's version stands apart for its distinctive 25 karat gold exterior coating, elevating its value to an astonishing $10 million. The gold exterior gleams brightly, announcing the owner's wealth and lavish tastes to all. The interior also features opulent details like gold accents on the steering wheel and dash. Another prized vehicle in Prince Turkey's collection is his custom Rolls-Royce Phantom Coupe, coated in a glossy 18-karat gold exterior. Typically priced at around $500,000, the finishing elevates the car's cost to around $18 million. Prince Turkey's affinity for gold-covered luxury vehicles is unusual, but deliberately meaningful. The golden sheen symbolizes prestige in an eye-catching manner suiting his dignified status. This ostentatious collection exemplifies his immense wealth through custom automotive art. Number 10. Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum of Dubai has indulged in some of the most extravagant luxuries thanks to a multi-billion dollar royal fortune. His lavish purchases range from a record-breaking racing camel to gold-plated supercars. As an avid animal enthusiast and owner, Sheikh Hamdan made headlines by acquiring the world's most expensive racing camel for $2.7 million in 2016. This transaction more than doubled the previous record, shocking camel traders worldwide. Named Murjana al Zabanaya, the female camel boasted exceptional breeding and athletic potential, according to the Sheikh. However, experts also noted the intended prestige of flaunting this prized desert creature before Saudi rivals. Regarding automobiles, the Faza Sheikh owns over 200 exotic cars, including a $1 million Mercedes SLS AMG, $2 million Bugatti Veyron, and 400,000 Lamborghini Aventador. Yet his most unique vehicles are gold-plated luxury and sports cars. His gold-coated Rolls-Royce Phantom Coupe, for example, conveys immediate royalty through precious 18-karat gold adorning the iconic grille. The Sheikh's gold Bugatti Veyron flaunts 24-karat gold stripes for added allure. Clearly, Sheikh Hamdan uses his vast wealth to acquire novel possessions that reinforce his noble stature. From golden supercars to million-dollar racing camels, he indulges in luxury experiences extending beyond the limits of most billionaires. Number 9. Mohammed Al-Fayed Mohammed Al-Fayed is an Egyptian billionaire internationally renowned as the former owner of the eminent Harrods department store in Knightsbridge, London. However, his vast wealth extends far beyond this iconic business. Al-Fayed boasts an illustrious portfolio of properties and investments reflecting his life of privilege. One of his most prized real estate assets is the Balnagown Castle and Estate located in the Scottish Highlands. Al-Fayed renovated this historic property after purchasing it in 1972, spending lavishly to restore it to glory. The sprawling 50,000-acre estate encompasses forests, farmlands, gardens, and even a private aerodrome. The castle itself is a majestic sandstone structure, incorporating design elements from the 15th to 17th centuries. The interiors are outfitted for modern luxury while retaining the period's architectural details. This restoration project is estimated to have cost more than $25 million over the years. In addition to Balnagown, Al-Fayed owns the ultra-luxury Hotel Ritz Paris, purchased in 1979. The prestigious hotel complements his reputation for living life to the fullest. Al-Fayed invested over $200 million into renovating the property in the early 2000s. Some of the lavish additions include a subterranean swimming pool lined with glass and gold tile work, and the redesigned Caesar Ritz restaurant, decorated with Louis XIV-style furnishings. Hotel Ritz Paris is regarded as one of the most elegant hotels in the world, befitting its owner's fortune and tastes. Beyond his properties, Al-Fayed has been strategic in his business investments. In addition to Harrods, he owns a 30% stake in the British retailer House of Fraser, purchased in 2010 for around $956 million. Given House of Fraser's reported annual revenue of $3.4 billion, Al-Fayed's share is valued at approximately $236 million. Number 8. Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani as the Emir of Qatar, Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani leverages his tremendous wealth to foster diplomatic ties in extravagant ways. One such example was his gift of a customized Boeing 7478 VIP jet to Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan. 
valued at $400 million. This grand gesture demonstrated the Qatar Emir's prosperity, as well as his interest in maintaining strong relations with the Turkish government. The aircraft's lavish interior configuration was designed for optimal comfort with a spacious seating capacity, bedroom suite, and five-star hospitality features. Sheikh Tamim himself shares a passion for luxury vehicles, though his personal collection emphasizes elegant British automotive styling. His garage contains several Rolls Royces and vintage Bentleys ranging from a 1956 Bentley S1 Continental to a bespoke $10 million Rolls Royce Silver Spur limousine. The Emir also owns a modern Bentley Mulsanne Vision concept, appearing at auto shows. With their handcrafted leather interiors and smooth, powerful engines, these cars exude refinement suiting royalty. However, Sheikh Tamim's most luxurious possession is likely his $500 million mega yacht Al Lusail. At over 305 feet long, this floating marvel of opulence includes two VIP suites, a grand piano, a cinema, and a helicopter landing pad. For the Emir, owning such a lavish vessel is a testament to his noble lifestyle. Number 7. Sheikh Saud bin Rashid Al Muwala. Sheikh Saud bin Rashid Al Muwala rules as monarch over the Emirate of Umm Al Quwain in the United Arab Emirates. He has leveraged his position to build an immense fortune estimated at 14.5 billion. A crown jewel among his assets is the Umm Al Quwain Investment Company, valued at over 500 million dollars. The investment firm focuses primarily on real estate and hospitality, developing projects that provide revenue while also raising the Emirates' economic profile. Thanks to the company's success, Sheikh Saud has become one of the wealthiest rulers in the UAE. However, he avoids flaunting his wealth ostentatiously. The Sheikh resides in the al Hadf Palace, or Umm al Quwain Fort, designed to incorporate both modern comforts and ancient heritage. This oceanfront palace blends traditional Islamic architectural elements like arches and courtyards with contemporary amenities. The entire fortified palace compound cost approximately 50 million to construct. While certainly luxurious, the Sheikh favors understated elegance befitting his moderate philosophical nature. He aims to position Umm al Quwain as as an inviting destination for international business and leisure travelers alike through prudent development. Number 6. Sheikh Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani As the former emir reigning from 1995 to 2013, Sheikh Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani oversees a personal fortune estimated at $2.4 billion. His assets and possessions reflect the wealth and privilege befitting royalty. Al Thani's primary residence in Doha, Qatar, is the Al Wajba Palace, which cost over $1 billion to construct. This architectural marvel exhibits the finest Islamic architectural design. The sprawling grounds include several outdoor swimming pools lined with ornate tiles. Within the palace, cavernous rooms dazzle with intricate gold detailing on walls, columns, artistic ceilings, and marble floors. Clusters of chandeliers embellish the soaring arched entry halls. The sheer scale and craftsmanship make this one of the grandest royal abodes worldwide. The former emir also boasts an impressive car collection with some of the most coveted luxury and performance automotive brands. It includes $2 million Koenigsegg supercars, 500,000 Lamborghini Aventadors, $1. million Pagani Huayras, and $2.5 million Bugatti Chiron. Several Ferraris also reside in his garages, such as La Ferraris, F12 TDFs, and Enzos, in his signature Ferrari Red. Each vehicle exudes power, beauty, and exclusivity, befitting a monarch with unlimited resources and impeccable taste. To facilitate moving between his palaces, Sheikh Al Thani utilizes his private Airbus A319 and Boeing 747S. When relaxing at sea on one of his luxury yachts, he can land helicopters on board as needed. The former Emir's way of life revolves around privilege in its highest form. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. The Saudi royal family are the richest Arab kings in the world, with an estimated net worth surpassing $1 trillion. Beyond the high-profile monarchs who dominate headlines, the House of Saud contains over 15,000 princes, many of whom live in secrecy and extravagance as billionaires in their own right. Tales of their decadence occasionally spill into public view. Several years ago, for instance, reports emerged about one prince's obsession with gold furnishings. According to sources, he gilded everything imaginable in his 
his palace, even mundane items like tissue boxes. Leaks also unveiled the scale of the family's gold reserves, valued higher than the bullion holdings of most nations put together. As the rumor goes, they have entire rooms filled top to bottom with gold bricks. What are your thoughts on the lavish lifestyles of Arab royalty like this? Let us know in the comments. Number 5. Hussein Sajwani as the founder and chairman of Dubai's Damak Properties, Hussein Sajwani boasts an estimated $4.4 billion in net worth. The real estate tycoon leverages his wealth to gift clients expensive supercars like Lamborghinis upon purchase of Damak's residential properties. One event saw Sajwani presenting luxury apartment buyers with keys to brand new Lamborghini Hurricanes worth over $200,000 each. His generosity aimed to create buzz while rewarding the brand's wealthy clientele with status symbols reflecting Damak's success. Yet for Sajwani, such lavish presents are business as usual. An avid car enthusiast, he owns approximately 400 million exotic vehicles kept within dedicated showrooms at his mansion in Dubai. Lamborghinis, Ferraris, Rolls Royces, Sajwani appreciates them all. His equally passionate car aficionado son, Ali Sajwani, developed an immense collection of his own from an early age. Ali's 500,000 Mercedes SLR Sterling Moss and matte white Lamborghini Aventador are among their shared toys. Together, Together, the Sajwanis own a treasure trove spanning over 400 high-performance and ultra-luxury automobiles. For this father-son duo, life in the fast lane is their normal. Number 4. Mohammed Hussein Al Amudi Saudi-Ethiopian billionaire Mohammed al Moody has accumulated tremendous wealth from his portfolio of business ventures and investments. Respected as one of the richest men worldwide, his lifestyle unsurprisingly reflects major prosperity. In Saudi Arabia alone, al Moody's real estate holdings are estimated to be worth around $3 billion, establishing him as one of the kingdom's largest private landowners. His assets include lavish mansions, palaces, and thousands of acres of property attractively situated throughout the country. He maintains an especially majestic home situated near the Saudi royal court for easy accessibility. The ornate furnishings, carved walls, marble columns, and lavish amenities provide a regal ambiance perfect for hosting distinguished guests and dignitaries. Beyond property, Alamudi's car collection vividly showcases his immense wealth. Valued at over $100 million, it encompasses some of the rarest supercars and hypercars on Earth. Brands like Ferrari, Lamborghini, Bugatti, and Pagani are well represented. Examples include a $2 million Lamborghini Veneno coveted for its extreme performance and spaceship-like styling. The $5 million Bugatti Chiron tops out at 261 miles per hour thanks to its 8-liter quad-turbo W16 engine. Alamudi even acquired a $12.4 million Pagani Huayra BC. Just 20 exist worldwide. Number 3. Taha Mikati Lebanese entrepreneur and businessman. Taha Makati has amassed a tremendous $2.8 billion net, worth primarily through investments in telecommunications. However, he also spends his fortune on luxurious possessions, like the lavish superyacht, Serene. Custom built in 2011 for over $125 million, the 440-foot Serene is equipped to cater to every need or desire. On board, the 24 guests and 52 crew members enjoy amenities such as a saltwater swimming pool, two helipads, a movie movie theater, a snow room, and a gym. The opulent interior features a distinguished contemporary style of sophisticated furnishings, rich woods and designer lighting throughout the lounges and cabins. One standout highlight is the gas fireplace in the main staircase. For ultra-indulgence, Serene also contains a world-class spa and massage suite. This peaceful retreat offers steam rooms, experience showers, water jets, and unlimited therapies. Guests can emerge renewed, restored, and ready for more pampering. In addition to Serene, Makati owns private jets and residences around the world, including an oceanfront estate in Palm Beach, Florida, purchased for over $100 million. However, Serene remains the crown jewel exemplifying his life of privilege. Owning this celestial kingdom grants passage into a realm of utmost luxury. Number 2. Mohammed Alibar. As one of the Middle East's most influential business magnates, Mohammed Alibar has led groundbreaking real estate developments while amassing tremendous personal wealth. His crowning achievement is the Burj Khalifa in Dubai, which remains his most iconic and prestigious project. 
Completed in 2009, the awe-inspiring Burj Khalifa stands at 2,722 feet as the world's tallest building. Alabar spearheaded its development as chairman of Amar Properties, investing over $1.5 billion into the record-shattering megastructure. While Burj Khalifa dominates Dubai's skyline, Alabar has also built up an impressive portfolio of luxury properties worldwide. These acquisitions reflect his immense wealth and refined lifestyle. Notable additions include a 45-room mansion within the prestigious Kensington Palace Gardens in London, purchased for over $120 million. This exclusive billionaire's row overlooks the illustrious Kensington Palace. Alibar owns several other ultra-high-value properties in Paris, including a stately home acquired for $400 million on Avenue Foch. He even owns an entire tropical island in the Seychelles rumored to have cost between $100 to $500 million when purchased in 2008. Number 1. Walid bin Ibrahim Al-Ibrahim Saudi businessman Walid bin Ibrahim Al-Ibrahim boasts an estimated net worth of $18.7 billion as founder and chairman of the Middle East Broadcasting Center, known as MBC Group. While not actively involved in politics, he leverages his wealth on ambitious business pursuits and an extravagant lifestyle. One previous real estate investment was a sprawling 27,000-square-foot oceanfront mansion purchased in South Florida for $16.2 million. The ornate residence occupied an entire island in Miami Beach, creating an oasis of luxury and seclusion. Amenities included a wine cellar, home theater, game room, 26-foot high domed ceiling, and over 200 feet of private ocean front. Unfortunately, the mansion was seized and sold several years later during legal disputes. For transportation, Al Ibrahim maintains an entire fleet of expensive automobiles, featuring limited edition models from luxury brands. His collection is estimated to exceed $500 million in value. While he owns several Rolls-Royce Phantoms and custom Mercedes S-Classes, his particular favorites are rare sports cars like the carbon-fiber-bodied Lycan Hypersport. Only seven were ever produced, each priced around $3.4 million. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.